1,136 kids attend Sims Elementary School in West Mobile County. The school is one of several in the system that's in dire need of repairs. It's an old school that's been patched up throughout the years. You know, if this was uh, a business location here or something like that, we feel it would be closed down because it wouldn't be a safe place for the for people to work. And the kids don't have any rights or can't speak for themselves, so we're going to speak for them and hopefully bring about some change. That's all we want. We're not asking for money. We just want our kids to go to school and be in a safe environment, in a safe building, and that's all we want. Lunsford is one of five parents who filed a lawsuit last Friday against the Mobile County school system. A lawsuit claims their children are forced to attend school in overcrowded, dangerous, and unsafe buildings. The parents want the school closed until the conditions are improved. Cindy Powell is the attorney for the parent group that filed the lawsuit. Desperate people have to do desperate things. And if it takes shutting the school down until it is made safe, then, uh, uh, you know, that's, that's what we're asking to be done. Bob Campbell is the school system's attorney. I don't, I, I don't think that a judge is going to tell us to close a, a school that's already overcrowded to relieve a condition that's not there. I'm not saying whether the school looks good or looks bad. They're basing their lawsuit on the fact that it's violative of public safety codes and rules. If it's not, I don't see a basis for lawsuit other than we want something done. Attorneys say they don't know just how quickly this lawsuit will move through the court systems. However, the first step for Barton Academy is to investigate the alleged violations. And meantime, the parents who filed this lawsuit say they will wait patiently for the outcome. In Mobile, James Gordon, Action News 10.